Boys, oh, we did do the little, we did the thing. We got a little, we got a little, let me just say this, okay? I like to see loot rain. I didn't know I like it. It's a new addiction. Something about golf balls just raining on you. Enhancement prisms and exotics. There's something sexy about it, and I don't get it. All I know was that there was an endorphin kick that kept going off every 12 and a half minutes this past week, and it was glorious. And I don't know what gets you off, fellas, but these Grandmaster rewards, it knocks the Hom car straight out of me. Now, experiencing this, I've come to the realization that number one, rewards inside of Destiny are just too damn stingy. They really are. And number two, anyone that defends the stinginess of Bungie in this aspect, bro, you're gatekeeping. Okay, let me just be real with you. You're gatekeeping. Gatekeeping ain't cool. Like, I don't know what the hell's to deal with it, man. We've got folks on the other aisle here, PvE and in PvP, that like to just sit around and go, no, you can't have that. Get good, son. And a lot of people kind of like chalk it up and go, oh, it's just the streamer saying that. Dude, I don't know one streamer that says that. Okay, I can name a few, but I'm not going to name them here. What I'm trying to get at is the vast majority of us that do play this game quite regularly, and I would say are part of the hardcore audience, really don't want to see the rewards being kept from people's hands. This double loot system, beautiful dude i love it just whenever i thought i was out bundy pulls me back in suddenly i found myself outfitting myself to go into another grandmaster nightfall despite me saying just a few weeks ago that i was done you want to know another playlist though that could really benefit from something like this trials of osiris but with a twist double loot would be nice inside of trials but you know what else would be better double progression what if every win counted for two you also get double loot drops from the three five and seven win rewards as well as a treasure chest there from the lighthouse now i understand my grounds for speaking about this is not trying to save trials of osiris it's simply just trying to get loot in your hands that's it and for my folks out there that are sitting there holding their astral horizon saying no that casual can't get this bro you didn't even get that legit you know you got a recovery done that's why you're holding on to it so tightly you're like oh no now everybody's gonna have something that i could have got for myself look i'm not trying to attack recovery sites today that's for another video you're probably watching an ad right now damn it regardless though gatekeeping's not cool stingy loot is also not cool but double loot i honestly think rewards of this level should become a frequent norm now we know bungie's actually doing things like triple infamy inside of game Gambit, which is nice for our Gambit players. Also, the loot changes they made to the raids a while back where you can continually keep doing the raids over and over again to have a chance of getting the raid exotics and other raid drops was also a fantastic adjustment. So it definitely seems like Bungie is moving away from this stinginess. But for this three and a half minute clip, I just want to point out to Bungie to keep going. Don't stop here, man. You don't got to remain stingy on the PvE side. Feel free to pick it up on PvP. And again, to my gatekeepers out there, chill. Fellas and ladies, thank you all for coming and watching and as always slap that like button like your mama told you right